Super Herd, and welcome back to Super Mario Odyssey. And today, we're gonna be making our way out of the Luncheon Kingdom and going somewhere else where we'll be, I guess we're finding out in a moment. Let's go. Okay, so where are we heading? I, I really wanna find out. We're filling up another sale, so I guess it really is going to be like a fully circular sale, but then is it really a sale? I mean, then it's just a balloon. The Odyssey is powered up. I guess they never, have they ever even called it a sale? Maybe they've always been honest with the idea that it's not a sale and it's more of a balloon. Okay, cool, either way, the Odyssey is powered up. We are good to go to the next kingdom, which will be, it's a total mystery to me, to you as well, it shall be. Ooh, I'm so excited. Now we can head to Bowser's Kingdom. Wait a second, oh, that can be, Really, already? Holy cow! Are we like at the end of the game? No way, Bowser's Kingdom. That is so cool, but at the same time so bizarre. Are we actually like almost at the, like the ready to beat Bowser? I mean, I guess our sale is almost fully filled. That might make sense. I'm surprised. I'm a little blown away. Could we be facing Bowser and finishing him off today? Okay. <laughs> I mean, hey, the sooner the better, that guy's a jerk. But I was expecting maybe a couple more kingdoms. Since he took the time to steal the stupendous stew, I imagine what he's surfing at the, I, I imagine that's what he's serving at the reception. Seeing as how we've got some time to kill, let's review some useful skills. Travel tip dive gym. We just learned this one last time. Okay, there we go. Now back to our investigation. Next up we have, whoa. The Bowser in Bowser's Kingdom, is that Bowser? I've got a bad feeling about this. So he knew about Bowser's Kingdom, but he didn't know, he didn't really piece together it was Bowser. Whoa, are we shaking? Why? Oh gosh, what's happening? Oh, are they intercepting, intercepting us? Okay, what in the, wait. What? What in the world, it's a real dragon? Where did this come from? You're gonna tell me this has been in the Mario universe the entire time? Hold on, you, let's see if I survive this plumber boy. What is happening? You can't just drop this on me. Oh my gosh, what? We're going down. Oh no, not again. Are we gonna land on the, the in the jungle again? Who are you? Why isn't that guy the main protagonist of this game? Like, holy cow. How, much, how big is Bowser's wallet to hire a guy like that? I'm like flabbergasted right now. What in the world? Ruined kingdom crumbled in. Are we in Dark Souls now? <laughs> what did you know it? The Odyssey is broken again. Yeesh, what is this thing made out of paper mache? To fix it, we must collect more power moons. There's no purple coins here. This is not a kingdom we want to be in. Coin. This. <laughs> I am not dressed for the occasion. I look. I'm a happy little painter. I can't go in, so I'm stuck in this costume. Okay, maybe I should have changed before. And what in the? Are we sure we didn't land in Dark Souls? <laughs> Did you know gaming? Dark Souls and Mario are in the same universe. Oh, look at this. Ooh. Ooh, what is, is this gonna be our first moon? Yes, it is. In the ancient treasure chest. Oh, well, I wonder, are there going to be more than three moons here? Because if there are th more than three moons, that means that there is a way to return here. Unlike the Cloud Kingdom, where there was no way to return, at least not yet. Maybe at some point there'll be a more explorable moon, or not moon, does that mean, Cloud Kingdom, right? Yeah, Cloud Kingdom. I don't know why, I just have so many, you know, terms in my head. Purple coin kingdom, moon kingdom, wow. We're not traveling anything, we're just flying. Uh-oh. Oh, I have a bad feeling about this. Oh, I have a really bad, oh no! What the heck is this thing? I mean, I guess it's a dragon. But I, I don't understand. No, oh, move, run! This is not what I was expecting when I thought I was gonna have a happy Mario adventure. A giant, evil, realistic dragon. Look at this thing, it's insane. It's like, I have been here the entirety of the universe. Oh, um, are you sleepy? You going in for a nap? Can I, I and I can't throw anything on his head, because he's got that crown. Oh, 
Oh, he's taking a nap. Are you okay, buddy? Oh, he's being brainwashed. Look at this. Oh, oh, okay. Boom. It worked. Oh gosh, oh, that just made him mad. Oh, it's back. Yeah, he's got stuff like crammed on his noggin. That must not be comfy. It's like the lion with the splinter in his stone. Not in my kingdom. Okay, wait a minute. Okay, hold on. I like the scratch marks, that's so cool. This is probably one of the coolest boss fights in Mario history, and I haven't even gone halfway through it yet. Like, this is amazing. I mean, so far it's actually not too difficult. I just don't have to, I just have to not miss all the time. There we go, get rid of that, get rid of this, get rid of that, and then just throw this. There you go, butt slam! Yeah, we can do this! I sure hope so, mama mia! Oh my gosh, and it gets worse every time. He's like, you're making it worse for me, buddy. So I wonder, maybe this guy's like really nice, you know? Like maybe he's like cousins with Shenron. Like maybe he's just a splendid guy. Maybe he's like the Gandalf of Mario. I mean, I don't see how. I mean, he might not be a wizard, but I just think like he's like has a deep lumbering voice and he's seen you know, a rather pleasant. Who knows? Or maybe he is just a monster and knows no better but to destroy whatever's in his path. But the ruin, like I need to know the backstory for this place. The ruined kingdom, we beat him. That moon in the background is so ominous. And you're down for the count. Holy cow. And we get a multi-moon for that. So we could have missed that moon originally, which means by concept, couldn't we come back here? Okay. Look at that, the dragon is defeated. Okay. Somebody get me an Excalibur. <laughs> Battle with the Lord of Lightning. Okay. Interesting. Why have we never seen him before? I want him to be a Mario Kart character. Oh, I want him to be the next Mario Kart. <laughs> that would be fantastic. Yeah. So it's all in the day's work for an artiste. Wait, look at that. There is a hint toad here. Hold on. Let's brochure this place up. Ruined kingdom. Stark land long past its glory days. Crumbled him. A grim reminder of past conflicts. High stakes reaching up for the heavens. Buried treasures. You'll see glowing spots scattered around the ground. Engage in some amateur archeology span by giving them a hearty stomp. This area is so small. Ruined kingdoms. Are there clues to what happened? Are there clues to what happened here? The Great Altarn. Doesn't it look like a creature of some kind? Yes, it does. Uh, are those claw marks? There's got to be a logical explanation, right? Three keys to the kingdom. Visit the vast crumbling tower. Still standing, watch over the area. Uh, investigating the deep coal-like marks in the stone. Admire the durable construction techniques of a once proud kingdom. Crazy cap. And there's actually five to find. Wowee. Should I try to find those? Excellent, we've got all the power moons we need. Oh wow, yeah, look at that. Oh, it's another one of those moon rocks. I think that might be the key to whatever else we can find here. <laughs> Having trouble finding power moons? I can help you, 50 coins. What do you want to buy a head, Sharon? Thank you, I'm right down your maps to take a look. No, there is another one over there. Can we just adventure that area now that there's not the risk of a giant dragon trying to eat us alive? I'd imagine so. Yeah, I guess there really isn't a way to redo boss fights in this game. Whoa, whoa, what is happening? He's just chilling, that is so creepy. That is like the creepiest thing. He just chilling, he's just like, you know, I'm just gonna sit here for a while. Oh, I got the worst migraine right now. Oh, I'm so sorry, I don't mean to hurt you like that. Look at this dude. This is the scariest thing. And we can just walk on him. Oh, no, 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 no! <laughs> Yikes, that's a long way down. We could live on him. He's crazy huge. Oh, and I'm way back here. <laughs> That's not what I wanted. All right, I'm gonna ignore you this time. We're just gonna get over here and go into this rocket ship. I mean, is this gonna be like a happy and cheery thing we're going to? <laughs> Cause that'd be funny. Oh, no, it's not. Look at this, wow. Okay, so a little button that cannot be pressed right now. And then this, oh, makes it pressable. What do you know? Uh. Oh, I see. So it stops the platform in a specific spot. So that, ooh, interesting. I like that. 
So before I even do that though, I might wanna... Oh wait, we never also changed out of our uh, painter's costume, but you know what? I like it. So there's nothing over here. I just had to make sure, ow, that hurt. That was unnecessary damage right there. Hmm, okay, I'm already on my last hit. I gotta be careful, run across it. Cool. All right, so that is an endless pit. I'm not just, uh, I'm just trying to make sure. Okay. Oh, more, wow, this is a bit of a puzzle, ain't it? Nah, I don't know if that's exactly what I wanted. Uh, let me try that again. Let's uh, slam that. And then, mm, okay, that'll work. It's gonna be difficult, but. Oh, yeah, look at that, okay, cool. It gives you coins, I guess, to identify that that's the right choice. Okay, I need to, I definitely wanna get up there, you see that? I think that might be something. So if I, uh, I can just hop up easy, okay. Oh my. Wait, why would I do this? Yo, what is the benefit of that? Why would I wanna hop down there like that? Weird. I feel like there, there's something more than it's letting on. Okay, get up like that. And, ooh, we're up here now. What is over this way? Wow, okay. This is a little bit weird. Hmm. I think maybe I could plop down from, like if we get to the top of the tower, maybe I could plop down from there. And, or maybe, Oh, I think I see, I think I understand. Wait, oh, you're back. Okay, Mr. Koopa. But I need to hit you like that and follow you. Whoa, look at this. Okay, this might be, yep, exactly what I was looking for. Now I can go down here. Ah, I'm sure that if we get to the top of this tower, we could also do something up there. I'll just like plop down from there, but I think this is more what we were supposed to, this is more the idea. So I need to be like, no, well, that'll work. That might not work, I might have to reset that. We're still on our last hit here, I gotta be very careful. Gosh darn it, okay, you know what? It is tough to time. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, okay? One, two, three, four, one, two, three, oh, <laughs> I pressed it with my big nose, okay. Didn't realize I could just bump into it. Thought I had to throw the hat, which adds a bit of delay, which makes it more difficult, yeah! Roulette tower stopped, interesting. See, there's actually a good number of moons around here. And, I mean, okay, not a good number compared to other kingdoms, but it's explorable. I wasn't expecting that. I thought maybe it would just be that boss fight and that's it. That is, I'm just still blown away by that giant stinking dragon. That's just crazy to me. Um, Okay, so I think what I wanna do here actually is do that. Can I jump up here? I can't quite make that jump. Hmm. Uh, I'm trying to find health. Be honest with you! I mean, I got the moon, so I'm back on full health actually. So maybe I shouldn't worry about it. I can't get up there like that. But there are certainly things up there. I mean, I could just do this then. Oh my. One, two, three, one, two, three, one. No, okay, see, that's why I don't like doing that line. Uh, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay, one, two, three, one, two, three, one. Nope, okay, I hit my nose on it again. I mean, it works, so I'm not gonna complain. It's just funny. It's just sort of comical. So I could get up, once again, I don't know why they give you the op op opportunity to reset like that. Or like go backwards, but they do. Okay, I don't think there was any way to get up any of those areas, but usually there's only two moons for this kind of stuff anyway, so I think we found it. There is another yellow moon. You got a moon, Rulet Tower climbed. Cool, what a creepy place this is. We're out of here. So beyond that, what can I find? I mean, I'm sure there's something. This dude is just chilling. You wanna open your mouth? Maybe we can go inside this. Wait, I could. So tired. Oh, that's it? Oh man, I wanted to have like a real conversation with you. Like, I feel like the amount of, I just, I need to know more about him. How old is he? Maybe he's like thousands of years old. I mean, how old is Mario supposed to be? I feel like they've confirmed he's like 30 something. And I would ima imagine Bowser's all that much older, maybe like 40 or 50 or something, you know? Peach would probably be the same age as Mario, maybe he's slightly younger. So like this guy must have so much information on what this world is, you know? Mario is, like the Mario world, you can't deny, it, it's quite the enigma at times. I would love to hear more. You know, I can't find any more hints for this kingdom. Like really, yeah, we have one more to find and that's probably whatever this moon rock has to do, which I'm pretty sure we won't figure that out until after the game's done. So, yeah. Unless there's just some obvious secret with him that I'm just totally missing. Either way, we have five out of the three moons that we need. 
So very, very cool. Oh wait, there's a, wait, why is there a button on top of the Odyssey? Oh, it's a symbol that looks like a button, you see that? I mean, maybe I've just been dealing with the button so much, but I might wanna run up there and check that out. The Odyssey is repaired, again. <laughs> cool. Oh, oh, we're just going. Okay, I just dropped my, <laughs> I dropped my Joy-Cons out of excitement. Um, oh yeah, and I don't get to change my outfit. I'm just permanently an artist. See you, dragon. That is insane. Like, I, I have so many questions, and I'm sure that's exactly why they will. Because now they can have like a, like a Dark Souls art style game and still say it's like in the Mario universe. Like, what if Waluigi is from that kingdom? Like, you don't know, you know? <laughs> oh my gosh. Like, obviously I'm going a little wild with it. Well, that was certainly a doozy of an interruption, but I'm glad we got the ship fixed. Seeing as how we've got some time to kill, let's review some useful skills, travel to side summer sun. Turn quickly in the opposite direction and jump to do a side somersault. You'll use all of your momentum from running it to jump backwards high into the air. Well, there it is. Next, let's look at the Bowser's kingdom. Hmm, architecture, statues, Bowser's castle, wait. He's got his own castle? Man, we gotta help those two. Okay, things are looking a lot less ominous now, which I love. I'm like so stressed out now that that was insane. Bowser's kingdom, Bowser's castle. Wow, it's actually, Enjoyably colorful. This is different. I mean, have we we've we've been to Bowser's Kingdom before? Infiltrate Bowser's Castle. I love the influences. It's definitely different than normal. I mean, I don't want to you know say something I don't know if it's true. This is it, the showdown. But it seems like it has a lot of a uh, Chinese sort of. I guess maybe like I want to no samurai is Japanese, but it has like a lot of a. Uh, Maybe it's more Japanese than it feels Chinese. I'm not really sure. I'm not incredibly versed in that culture, but no matter what it is, it's awesome. I love it. Oh, that is ominous. It just opened the door. Come on in, Mario. But I love it. It's a very traditional kind of wedding. It's like, you know, not the American kind, which is what I'm mostly used to. What is up here? There's surely something. Purple coins. Whoa. Look at those. Those are cool. I mean, I don't know what they're called. I mean, maybe they are just coins, but. <laughs> Uh, I'm not really sure too much what these kind of coins are called. Uh, but we got four of them. That's all I see. Ooh, there are some other coins here. Is there anything I can do with a, a Goomba stack? I love the music. Dude, this area is so cool so far. Um, oh, there is something truly over here. Um, oh, okay, it's a 10 Goomba stack. Holy cow, so I think if I wanna do that, I should start from the top. And also, I should stop being an artist. I wanna go and turn into normal Mario before we do anything more. Um, so let's get across to there. Come on, Mario, roll around. I wonder, is there gonna be a, oh, I wonder if there's gonna be a Cap Kingdom around here. Not a Cap Kingdom, a Cap store. Whoa, okay, I was, I was switching, uh, flipping my controller around. It was uh, freaking out on me. Um, so we just need to do that and do that. Cool. So now we're back to being in our normal dreads, exactly what I wanted. Now we can truly adventure this. I just, I just like doing that, you know? It, it works for me. Okay, so let's get across to here. Uh, the doors have to reopen, that's fine. So let us go ahead and just start working on this. Because if we, we gotta use our height as an advantage. There we go. So we need 10 of them. And it looks like there's exactly 10, ow. So I'm messed up that one. It is, it sort of gets like floatier to jump, but harder to control. No, did we just destroy him? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, no, we got him. Let's whittle waddle, whittle waddle, whittle waddle, whittle waddle. And got it. That is so cool. And the moons are red. This deep, ominous red. Yeah, stack up above the wall. So, since I don't need you guys no more, I will. Oh, okay, leave you be, leave you be, leave you be, leave me alone. <laughs> <laughs> like, what were you gonna do, Mario? What were you gonna do? Nothing, nothing. Get out of here. Goodbye. Once again, we're just launching into the air. Whoa. Okay, third courtyard, front. Look at you. Oh, you guys are so cute. Oh, that's so cute, Pokemon. <laughs> I love on guard. <laughs> These guys are my favorite. Oh, look at that. Um, So I can poke and then launch. Oh, that is so cool. I love these guys. Oh, that is so, so cool. Let's get over here and get some purple coins and an easy peasy moon down there. I'll have to make sure to grab that. Let's actually take a look at the brochure. Bowser's kingdom, well def defended castle floating among the glowing clouds. Bowser's castle, the castle that walled off the sky. 
beautiful tile work, terrifying gatekeepers, mallets big enough to climb on. Ooh, that's a hint. Um, architecture, ar architecture as lovely as the scenery, the whole thing. All along the walls, there are these holes. These holes were meant to allow defenders to shoot at invaders, but nowadays you're more likely to find a demon or snake coming out than an arrow. Wow. Statues guard the court. Statues are not, they are certainly imposing. Has Bowser always had this kingdom? But where rolling ordinance, impressive fortifications, and oasis of calm, these statues called Jizo stand in a row. Oh, we could definitely become those. It's like the uh, statue Tanuki Marion. Three keys to the kingdom dart past the silent and lethal staircase ogres. Avoiding, avoid being distracted by the ominous yet brightly glowing clouds. Survive the various traps designed to end your trip early. So cool, and how many? We have 45 moons to find, 100 purple coins. Very crazy, so let us get a couple more. Now we're up to eight. Oh, there, yeah, there's something down here. I already noticed that, I don't know why it surprised me so. But yeah, we could plop down here and get this. Behind the big wall. Cool, no, no wait, no wait, no wait, no wait. Darn it, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Okay, well, lesson learned, be careful where I walk. Probably should've learned that on the first level. Okay, so let's uh, become you. I love their little hats too, like these guys. They're a charm, I love them. So we could just like, wah, wah. This is so much fun, I love it. So let's go ahead and get Yoon. Does Bowser even know we can become other things? Like I haven't really thought about it too much. Like, maybe he just hasn't been paying much attention to us and doesn't even realize that we can consume other things. There we go. And we are flying, yeah, the, the moons are, not the moons, the clouds, I call everything moons now. The clouds are distracting. But you know what, that's a good thing. They're awesome. So, uh, I didn't need to dodge you guys, but I want whatever is in here, and ow. Okay, you know what, you guys are mean. I'm not inviting you to my wedding, that's for sure. Oh wow, okay, I'm supposed to dodge him now. Go, 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 go. Let's do that, so I can just, oh, that was a good move. Good move indeed. So there is another red moon for us. We have found two so far, and we're about to find a third. Cool. Taking notes between spinies. Oh yeah, I always forget. It's like, why, what does he mean take notes? Because they're musical notes. Does he, bro? It's not that hard to figure out. Whoa, it's one of these big dudes. Okay. Whoa, whoa. I feel like they have something on their head. Like, let me try to maybe, yeah, he's gonna slam, and we're gonna jam. Ready? Boom. Hey, we got it. He's like, no. Hey, that's how we get them. Cool. Let's go ahead and get this one. That is a first event moon in Bowser's kingdom. This is so intense. Infiltrate Bowser's castle. So cool. Okay. Wow. So this is gonna open up. And then the doors open as well. I already see a lot of stuff ominously waiting for us. Smart bombing. I'm gonna guess it's gonna be quite the gauntlet to actually get to Bowser down. I'm sure he's prepared for it this time. I mean, he seems more prepared to you know, defeat us than ever, because he's always been one step ahead of us. Okay, so let us um, get over to here. Apparently we're avoiding some bombs, but before I do any of that, I wanna try to get up there. I should be able to if I like, one, two, three. Yep, look at how easy that was for me. Then, ooh. Oh, there must be like one of those birds around here then. There definitely has to be. Yep, there you are. Okay. And then what is up here? Anything really? I mean, this is the area I've been to before, so this is really this the other side of that wall. Oh, look at that. One of these has a hole. Just gonna probably be a worm in here? Or not. What if I poke my little nose in there? Um, no, no, hold on. Oh, hey, look at that! Oh, that's so cool! Pretty smart, pretty smart. Poking your nose in the plaster wall. Cool. So let me get across to here. I love these guys. These might be my one of my favorite transformations so far. They're really cool. Okay, so let us, um. yeah, we're gonna get over there. That might be really challenging, but I'm up for the challenge. Oh my. Oh. Yes, that's good. Oh boy. Oh, no, 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 okay, at least I got him. That is so weird. Like the, the direction how it works is really odd. Okay, 1,843. So now we're way back here, that's not a big deal. But we got everything over on that side. I'm just gonna check all these golden sort of, what are they, one, two, three, four, five, six, hexagons, right? Um, 
yeah, let's get across from all of this, because I don't need to deal with it no more. But I need to get on this side, which this side is definitely easier to get up to. I don't know what's going to be up here too much. If there's going to be anything worthwhile. I'm sure there is, because there's clearly platforms to get up here. Oh my gosh. Not what I meant to do. Not at all. Okay, should be easy enough just to run over here and get them. So we're seeing, seeing, you know, some purple coins. We're not having too much of a problem getting them. I think we've gotten, like so far, everything in this kingdom that we have passed, we have gotten. We haven't run into anything we just can't quite do yet. So that's pretty cool. Well, let's go across to here. Oh, look at all these purple coins. Okay, first get the checkpoint for sure. If we die, we can respawn here at the second courtyard. So we have one more courtyard after this, and then maybe we'll be at the castle? So a lot, a lot more challenges. Ooh, what if I take care of like all the torches? Okay, I'll try to keep that in mind. Like maybe that's something. Um, there we go. There we go. That's all the torches I see for right now. But if I find more, I'll take those out too. So yeah. Oh, look at that! They're moon medallions. So grab that. We might want to try to. Oh, well that must have hurt. Can these guys maybe? Uh, no, they can't. So how do I get these bombs maybe to move? Oh, like that. Oh, ho, ho, that was cool. So let's, ooh, nice. I bet you there are some moon medallions hidden away in these boxes, so we wanna try to make this as accurate as possible. All right, let's try to hit this one next to it. There you go. That did not have a moon medallion in it, but it could have. You know, that's the thing, that's the idea. Boom, oh, a little off for that left one. Boom, also a little off. Come on, yeah, perfect, cool. And what about other places around here? And there's another moon medallion. Oh, you know what, let me try to break these. That looks like it could be something. Like, I wouldn't imagine these are just here for coins. You know, that seems a little silly. Boom, oh, a little off. Oh, there was a heart in there. I need to line up, like, just right. Wait, oh, no, <laughs> was not ready. Got it, yeah, that's it. So that was just a heart, but that's fine. You know, hearts are good. So let's uh, get rid of you, and you, and you. Oh, ow, that hurt. Oh, oh, here we go, three more. I love this little bird guy. He's so much fun, and he's so cute. Like that's a great combo to have. It would be really cool if there is a crazy cap around here. Um, so first off, let's get rid of this torch, and then I will grab that and then become Yoon, because it's definitely worthwhile to be Yoon. Oh wow, okay, so I can't climb up that. This dark, you know, black iron, and just our beaks aren't strong enough, unfortunately. We can try our best, but it might not get us much results. So I need to just go to the edge of this, and, Yep, just do that, and then recapture you. So, so far, so good. I don't, once again, I don't see anything that we can really miss around here. Oh, that's not really what I wanted. <laughs> I wish we could fly. We don't actually use our wings at all for being a bird. That's quite interesting. You know, it's not the first bird that's like that, but uh, usually, you know, if they're not for wings or like for flippers or something, there's nothing down there, right? Doesn't look like it to me. Oh, boing. Should we get up here, or will we just hit our noggins? Yeah, we'll just hit our noggins. That's unfortunate. Hmm. Oh, yeah, get that out of here. I don't wanna deal with it, do you? Ooh, what is, whoa, whoa, no, I wasn't close enough to the wall. Oh, darn. Uh, that's really tough. It's just really easy to get away from the wall. Maybe I should be getting up there first. You might be able to see. Clearly, it's trying to, you know, lead me this way as well. So maybe I'm uh, going a little bit off the uh, mark for now. Let's try over here. Oh. Okay, we're doing pretty good. Yeah, what is gonna be over here? I'm sure something worthwhile. Um, immediately I'm not seeing too much, just some couple coins, but down here, we got some purple coins. Okay, ooh, that is so tough. Especially since like, whoa. Oh. Like once you like extend the nose, you have to wait a second before you can re-extend it, so you just sort of have to hope you do it right. Hmm, and there's still more ways over here. Oh, there's not as much of a lip to this roof. So we could actually just hop up like that. Ooh. And there was another moon medallion up here, so that was totally worth it. There's four out of five. Okay. Unfortunately, yep, all the torches came back. I feel like that is something I wanna try, but at the same time, is it really worth it? I mean, it might be, but it would also be a huge waste of time if it doesn't actually end with anything. So this is where I was out trying to go before. That's sort of rude that the bomb can fall down there. Okay, go across like that, go across like that. Nice, that was really good. So we need to angle ourselves up just right. Nice, good, okay, that was really good. So we are really churning through. Let us get back up here, and then behind here, we find ourselves a secret little moon. This is treasure inside the turret. The turret? 
What turret are we talking about here? All right, so it looks like I'll have to leave my little birdie friend here. Oh my, whoa, where are we going? Way over here, okay. Yeah, what do I have to do to get the moon here? I need to find all the medallions, of course. So where's the next one? Yeah, probably up there. What I should do is also check all these boxes because you never know, there might be, yeah, look at that one right there. Boom. Uh, boom. That is our final moon medallion. Cool, cool, cool. But there might be purple coins in these. Like, I really don't know what else there could be, but it's definitely probably worth searching. So let us uh, do that. Um, no. Let us do this. Okay, there's one. There is another. Good, good, good. And then grab that. Cool. Grab this. And then that one. And then lastly, these two. Obviously, it's not doing too much for us, but you know what? It's actually sort of fun, so I don't mind. There we go. Then what about up here? Now, I don't think I'm gonna be able to get up here normally. Like, as you can see, there doesn't seem to be an area except for the back of it. Ooh, hoo, hoo. what is gonna be up here then? I'm, I'm really curious. Might just be a moon, might be a purple, a couple purple coins, but no matter what, I'm happy to have them. Okay, so that definitely looks like everything over here, unless there's like, Nope, there's not, okay. So let's go ahead and get this purple coin, and that's another event done. This area is so much fun so far. Real challenge, but smart bombing. Cool. The red ones look like they're like cherry. Like it looks really tasty. Maybe I'm just hungry. I'm always hungry. Uh, ooh. We got, I don't know. I'm just like amazed by everything. The cloud colors are just so nice. Big, brutal battle. Ooh, now that is something that, ooh, about. look at those statues. Bowser's straight modeling. Like, if he, if he ever wants to stop being a tyrannical, I guess like a dictator, I mean, he is sort of just a bad guy all around. If ever he wants to give up that day, that kind of lifestyle, I mean, I think he should become a model. I think he would tear up the model scene. I mean, would he be plus size? I mean, I guess it depends on who he's modeling to. Okay. <laughs> Let us get off that tangent and get some purple coins and an easy moon. Look at this bad boy over here. Just chilling out, I'll gladly grab you from the side above the castle gate. And that really looks to be everything for this uh, this courtyard, so I'm gonna go ahead and head out of here. Flying on over this way. Whoa, hey, look at that, I was right there, there's a cap kingdom. I'm not a, why do I always call it a cap kingdom? It is a cap store, a crazy cap. Oh, hey, there's humans here. That's sort of weird. Welcome. So let's go ahead and get our Bowser's Kingdom heart, um, moon. Thanks. Why are there humans here? Why can't I, you know, I wanna meet Bowser. Shopping at Bowser's Castle. I mean, Bowser might be a bad guy to Mario and Peach and stuff, but beyond that, he seems like a pretty nice dad. A uh, samurai helmet, ooh, look at all this! Okay, so definitely gonna get the samurai helmet. The samurai wore helmets that were functional and fancy. I got those little coins on the top of it. All right, you're welcome. So we'll go ahead and change that now. The samurai helmet is really gonna work on you. I'd say, so samurai armor, the samurai basically walked around wearing works of art. Is what you wanted? Yep. Thanks. Okay, so we'll equip that. We don't have enough to buy the rest of this stuff. Oh, look at this Bowser Kingdom sticker. Cool little, uh, I guess, like cards. I hope we see you again. I'm sure you will. Okay, so cool, look at us. So let's get out of here. So yeah, we're a samurai now. And then let us walk around this area. I'm sure there's more. Oh, oh, hello. Oh yeah, look at that, right on the other side. You wanna get a look-see on what's going on inside? You gotta be dressed for battle, friend. That armor, you look like a samurai. Well, step right in. Right this way. Cool. Humans are working with Bowser, though? Typical humans. <laughs> okay, well, um, and that's sort of the thing. You know, I've talked about it before, but if there's humans in the Mario world, there has to be zebras, right? Oh, look at this! Oh, that is so cool. Okay. Ooh, this is so cool. Wait, I wanna break these, um, just in case. Okay, this one has some stuff. And if there is a potential of being a zebra, then that means maybe there's a potential of me meeting Mario or Bowser. You know, they're both cool dudes. Okay, uh, let's wait for that. Or Luigi. I'd, I'd, I'd hang out with Waluigi, not Waluigi. <laughs> I would not hang out with Waluigi. I think he'd just steal my stuff. Uh, but if I would hang out with Luigi, this is so interesting, I love this. I'm going on the weirdest tangents today, then. Probably shouldn't have done that yet. Um, I probably could have picked up some of the notes with that. Okay, so do that. Oh my, get a couple of those. This is our first time doing like a little music note thing in the portrait mode or the, whatever this is called. I call it a portrait because it sort of looks like it, right? 
Yeah, taking notes in the folding screen. Cool. Is that it? Now there's gonna be another one. Cool. So what we gotta do here is we gotta land on you and push you. And then we gotta lower this enough so that it breaks the blocks. Ooh. Okay, that's actually really tough. That's actually really tough. Okay, there we go. Getting it a little bit lower. If we could get it inside of there. And okay, that's, why am I having such a hard time with this? Maybe I should land on it? Oh, that's, that's also tough. There we go. Okay, that's enough for me to get in there. There we go, okay. Scene of crossing the poison swamp. Yeah, that is quite the scene. Cool. There's two more moons for us. It looks like that's all we can do in this area. Um, should we switch back to normal Mario then? You know what, yeah. Because I feel like if we're gonna be facing Bowser, we're gonna have some like cool final cutscenes. I wanna do them as basic Mario because I just think that looks cool. And hey, look at that. Some easy purple coins in here as well. 42. I need 45 in total to uh, get the next thing I want. Hmm. Oh, look at this. Okay, hold on. We got these little statue guys and we can become these ones because they don't have a hat on. <laughs> he does look like a Tanuki Mario. I love that. And what if we put you here? Yeah, okay, that worked. Cool, so there's one more on top of the little rock. And then what about over here? You can see there's a bit of a statue, not a statue, what am I talking about? A bit of a uh, like an indentation. Jizo all in a row. Can I just butt stomp this? I can't, but what if I did become another Jizo? Can I become these guys? I can't. Their hats are on there nice and tight. <laughs> this is so much fun. Now let's uh, stomp stomp on over here. Yeah, look at that, whoa. And there's basically another row of G's out. All right, and... Yeah, okay. That's a pretty easy one. Oh, it's going over there. And got it. Underground G-Zone. Cool, so let me go back and switch to normal Mario now. I think that would be a little bit more interesting. Okay, let's uh, do that and get on into here. It's been one heck of an episode though, I'll tell you that much. We still haven't reached the first courtyard though, the last, yeah, the last courtyard basically. Let us get over it. And I figured that maybe we'll do like a showcase of every single costume once we have every single costume. I mean, maybe we want to like select it, hop out, and then go back in. I'm not sure. But at least, if, you know, show them all up. I think that would be fun. But okay. Let us keep on going on, because I think we found just about everything in this area. It's quite the expansive area, but at the same time not, because it's small. Uh, let us, uh, I mean, I, I won't call it expansive, but it's well used. Oh, this one's, is this one just a moon sitting here? It's not, okay. Then let me explore a little bit. Ooh, this place is crazy. What can I do with you? I'm sure there's something we can do with you. Wait, it is glowing. Maybe I could just stomp these areas out, I can. Then I'm sure around here there will be a moon again. Maybe. Not yet, but maybe soon. I love the little noise it makes. Like dun 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 What is this then? Maybe if I hang out with it, it'll give me things, not quite. There's surely something I can do with this guy. What is over there? I'm not sure. Maybe I need to be a portrait. Hmm, cool. Oh, let's get back over there. I love all the flags too. This area is so wonderful. But there's surely something I can do with it. Maybe I can go on the other side. Maybe there's just something to you know, break like before. Because there's obviously more over here that wants me to go this way. But he's having a very cool wedding. Like if it wasn't for the fact that it's a like a forced arranged marriage. Oh, hey! Yeah, you guys have nothing on me. Sorry. <laughs> you tried, you failed. Oh, look at this! I can't go through that one. Why not? Hmm, what activates a portrait? I'm not really sure. I was hoping there'd be more to do with this thing. Well, unfortunately, it doesn't seem to be the case. Unless breaking them all will get something done for me. Oh, hey, there's more health. Cool, up to six health. So I'll just get over here. Okay, I've done them all. I'm gonna keep as this guy. Or maybe not. It does take a while to get from point A to point B with this. So I'm just gonna leave in. I, I know where to find you then. So uh, don't call me, I'll call you, basically. Ooh, what is this? Oh, hey, that's how we get over here. Fancy, look at how far we're going. That is so crazy. Hmm, okay, these guys are a little scary though. Hmm, okay, don't hurt me, please. Thank you. 
And then I can destroy you. Because I just think that's a good idea. You guys are monsters. And I don't know if one of them's gonna have a moon, or maybe I get a moon for probably I'll probably get a moon and I'll land on that little pedestal. But can you destroy these blocks soon? Or not? Actually, yeah, I'm gonna see if I can't get you to destroy these. I mean, maybe that's not worthwhile. But I'll just try to get him to like destroy a couple of What? Okay, I just barely got out of there. Jeez. Like, yeah, that's sort of the thing. Would I get something if I get him to destroy all these blocks? I feel like that would take way too much time. That'd be a bit of a tedious moon. But it's definitely possible. Yeah, just get rid of you though. I'm not gonna worry about it. It'd be cool to become one of those guys. I mean, maybe I can. Like, maybe I'm missing something here. Maybe when they uh, slam down like this. No, it does not look like I can become them. Okay, wait, I can't get up. I can't get up. Oh boy. All right, well, now I'm up here. And... Wait, no. Ha <laughs> ha, no. Wait. Ha <laughs> ha. Gotcha. Oh, that's all of them beaten. That didn't. Okay. Just took a second. Gotta be a little more patient, Zebra. So let us get over there and got it. That is exterminate the ogres. Really weird that they're ogres. I think they'd be a bit more green. So let us get out of here and, and adventure maybe the other side. Like I'm sure the other building might have something of interest. It'd be weird if it did not. So that guy's just chilling out there. I find that interesting. Oh, well, I missed, okay. My platforming skills are not interesting because only good things are interesting, right? I guess bad things can be interesting. But then my platforming skills are not interesting. All right. Oh, look at that! Okay, that was some pretty skillful platforming now. There's 45 out of 100. We're almost halfway there with finding all the purple coins. Before I go any further, get the checkpoint. Main courtyard entrance. So we can't just waltz on in. Or can we? Oh no! I forgot the two last brutals. Hi! <laughs> the boss wasn't kidding when he said you two were persistent. But I owe it to the family. Tell all the Brutals to come at you with everything I got. Okay, is it just you? I guess so. I figured that maybe, oh, you know, we probably have to take you out and then go on that platform and do the same thing to his little sister. I mean, I guess we are a family, you know? All right, boom. Well, I'm not too worried about you. I wonder how this happens. Is it determined that, you know, I face this guy here at the end or could it have been any Brutal and it just depends on the order I do it or maybe just random happenstance. I am not playing well, by the way. There we go. Let's get rid of some of these, huh? I mean, am I supposed to be getting rid of them? Sure, why not? Um, whoa, that's a lot of hats, buddy. <laughs> Ouch. You would really like Team Fortress too. Okay, come on, come on. Oh gosh, what in the world is he doing? Okay, he's break dancing. He's a dancing bunny. Come on, come on, come on. There we go, that's what I'm looking for. Does he, oh, he takes three hits now. He just doesn't take uh, the tune. Okay, um, oh, oh, okay, they're everywhere. Do I, I, I really don't know how this works. Do I have to get rid of all of them? Like maybe eventually, I you know he'd come back, but I think that if I destroy them all, he'll just, or maybe I have to find the hat he's in. I'm not really sure how that works, either way. Oh gosh, oh gosh, move it, move it, move it. Ow, that, that was painful. Um, let me be careful. Come on, get out of here. Good, good, good. And then maybe I could do a bit of that. Oh, that did not work out at all. I'm taking all sorts of damage. I gotta get, destroy him. Don't run, don't run, you coward, you coward! Uh, got him. Jeez, I couldn't have gotten any closer. <laughs> You're done for. See ya. Okay, oh, whoa. Is that gonna be an extra moon for me? It's not. Can I get a refill anywhere? Um, because I would like a health refill. There is at least one extra health. I guess it's supposed to be a bit of a gauntlet, huh? I mean, what if I go back to the checkpoint? I bet that would give me some extra health, right? No, it doesn't. Interesting. Okay, so let's go ahead and do this one. Oh my. And they're flying back in. Now it's just her. Hi. You're gonna say anything? Yep. The wedding's almost the here. I was gonna say there. <laughs> the boss is getting ready to keep up ahead in the keep up ahead. I can't read, but you two can scram because you're definitely not invited. Okay, she's the last brutal we have to fight. Let's do it. Oh my, she, I feel like she's gonna be like one of the most difficult here. I mean, we only have two hits to deal with her. I mean, we went from six health to one with the other guy. I feel like I was a bit foolish with, oh yeah, I remember now. We gotta knock these back at her. That is tough to do. But now that I'm a little caught up, because we, we never faced her a second time, did we? I mean, I guess we faced all the Brutals a second time, and that's it, and now that we faced her. Okay, so I actually, oh, I gotta get over there. Don't land in the lava, thank you. Okay, so pick up these coins, I guess actually maybe it might be a bit foolish to try to get coins when I only have two health. 
I'm gonna conserve it as much as I can. So I just need to dodge those, which shouldn't be too big of a deal. I probably could have, should have gone to those boxes over there. I probably could have gotten my third health. Okay, so, ow, that was dumb of me. That was really dumb. Well, there goes my hit. I mean, I really didn't need to take it that way, but I did. Okay, so, that's not gonna do too much. So I could, you know, probably knock these over if it wasn't for the fact that she throws them so far, or I can wait for her to do the little swing attack like this. Oh, oh my. Ooh, whoa, the splash damage got me? Really, okay. I thought I was far enough away, but maybe not. Well, I get to try it again. Do I have to do both of them again? I do not, okay. Well, that's something. Let's try this again. <laughs> I'll skip it. Okie doke. Let's fight face her and hopefully do it correctly this time. Whoa. If I get closer to you, you'll throw them not as far, right? That might be helpful. Oh yeah, that's basically the case. Boom! Oh, I didn't! Oh, that is the biggest bunch of malarkey I've ever seen. Okay, you know what? Do your slam. Yeah, how's it feel? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Land on your head? You're not quite dead? I mean, I don't wanna kill you. I just want you, I just want you to stop. I just want you to stop being mean to me. Okay, well, she's all over the place. I need to be careful because of the lava. But as long as I know just not to do anything silly, I should be fine. She's really barricading herself in the lava. It'll eventually disappear. Basically, it's just like, it's just better to dodge. So, I'm gonna try to dodge. All right, she's throwing that stuff everywhere. Come on, come on, whoa, okay, I forgot that. Oh, come on, I'm the worst of all time. It's not this difficult. It's just me being bad at the game. There we go, hit it. Just gotta do that one more time, and we're good. There we go. I could use some extra health. And yeah, like some extra health popped up with the other dude. But not for you. Oh, oh, I didn't know I could do that. Okay, that ends it the early. Oh, okay. Um. Okay, and then just, to I threw my hat. What are you talking about? Okay, I have a better start now. I hit her basically right away without taking any damage. But now I know that if I hit this, that's gonna make things a bit quicker now. So what I need to do is get like really close to her and hopefully she'll lob them very close to her as well. Like that, and then, wait, oh, I couldn't, Ah, oh, man, you just don't get the chance to hit those. Yeah, I don't think you can really possibly do that. I mean, I'm gonna try one more time. And then, oh yes, that's what I wanted. Cause then I like, I don't even have to, what are you doing, where are you going? Calm down, there you go. See, then I don't even actually have to deal with her doing all the things she does. So she's gonna plop one somewhere. You're gonna move really quickly this time, though, it's a problem. There we go, got her, though. I just need her to throw one more bomb that I can actually hit back. So I was waiting out some things. I actually didn't need to wait out. So technically I made it more difficult for myself than I had to be. Um, oh, I'm trying to hit that back to her. And it ain't working out too well. No, that's, they just, hmm. Okay, well that's fine, because as long as she does this, um, and then I can get over there. Nice, ow, that hit, that hit me? You stinker, you're going down. You're going down, lady, or not. She runs around pretty quickly. I mean, I guess she is larger than Mario. She has longer legs, so she can get away pretty quickly. But you're down for the count this time. Awesome. <laughs> and another statue gotten. Cool. And that is probably the last red moon until we go to Bowser's kingdom. Okay, another event cleared. Big brutal battle. Okay, that's what I said. I thought I said bio brutal. I'm like, bio brutal? Did I miss something there? They aren't like mutants now. <laughs> oh my. So the bridge opens, or the, the bridge extends, and the door opens to show showdown at Bowser's Castle. Oh my. Intense. Okay. So, in the next episode of Super Mario Odyssey, we're gonna make our way straight down here, beat Bowser's butt, get Peach back, and avoid this wedding from happening. Sounds great to me. Thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of Super Mario Odyssey. I hope you enjoyed it. If you watched this one video, make sure you comment Samurai Zebra so now you've watched the end that you are a Zebra-tastic viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now or by subscribing to join the Zebra Herd. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.